triple A predicts almost 7 million of us will hit the road for the holiday in California and the rain won't help speed anything up. And things are already going slow on the freeways tonight. Yeah, KCAL's Joy Benedict is in Ontario to show us why tonight is expected to be extra tough. It's one of those things that you know it's going to hurt, you know it's going to be painful, but we're going to get in our car anyway as holiday traffic goes right along with the turkey, the cornbread, the stuffing, and the greens and the gravy that all come with this long weekend. Regardless of which freeway you're going to be riding on, you can imagine it's going to look like this, just kind of inching along. So get ready for it. Pump the brakes and settle in, for you may be on a SoCal freeway, but the speedometer looks like a school zone. Yes, definitely slower going. Kevin Holmes is a rideshare driver, so he admits he likes the longer times as they bring in more money. So something went over like 20 minutes, 25, 30 minutes. But for the rest of us, these red lights flashing on the freeway are simply a headache. As soon as people get off work at 2 and 5 o'clock, the freeways are going to be packed. It doesn't matter which one you pick. And travel experts agree. Tonight is the night that turkey traffic is trouble. This is the busiest day. AAA says Tuesday night will see the highest change in traffic volume of 38% as the hottest destinations for this long weekend are, well, in every direction. The most visited locations this Thanksgiving weekend are going to be the Central Coast cities, San Diego, uh, Grand Canyon, Las Vegas and um, Anaheim. Drivers out and about say they know. It's fine. I mean, it's not bad. There's traffic a little bit, but it's not bad. You've seen it worse. That's why I'm trying to get my errands out the way so I don't have to do too much traffic. I'm always late. I'm going to still be late. So. As stuck in traffic may be a procrastinator's favorite excuse, but when it's reality, it is everyone's nightmare. For the holidays, just deal with it, basically. You can't beat the traffic. But as tough as it is to sit in slow moving traffic, imagine if you were stopped altogether. Believe it or not, AAA is expecting to get 140,000 calls in California alone for roadside assistance with the biggest issues being tires or a car battery. So make sure you check and double check all of those things, especially if you're heading on a long drive. From Ontario, I'm Joy Benedict, KCAL News. Advice from Joy there and stay with KCAL News. Coming up at 530, the best and worst times to travel if you're leaving tomorrow.